you want to put them to a minimum. You want them to be 15 to 20 grams of saturated fat in your diet or less. 15 to 20 or less in your diet a day. Now if you've had heart surgery, your physician may put you on a 5 to 8 gram saturated fat diet. And we want, when choosing our saturated fats, we want to gravitate to the monounsaturated fats, which is canola oil, olive oil. Not that it still doesn't have saturated fat in it, because it does, but it's less than other types of fats and oils. Um, also, we need to make sure we read the labels of how much saturated fat. Make sure it's below 15 to 20 grams a day. Okay. Um, and depending on the size of you, it may be even a little bit less than that. Um, but that's just a rule of thumb that most physicians give out. Um, also, remember to look on the food label for trans fats. Okay. Sure, we have a government now that makes us put the trans fats on our labels, but you still need to make sure that you look at them. Even though they say zero, they still have some probably form of saturated fat in it unless it's a fresh food. So I tell my clients that they're like they're married. Saturated fats and trans fats are married. So just because it says zero trans fat, it may still have like three grams of saturated fat in it. So we need to really um, address that when we're looking at our food labels.